All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we are at the St. Mary's Railroad Museum. Over here, here I am. Ooh, hey, hey everybody. St. Mary's Railroad Museum, we got a very special thing here, okay? Doug is off camera, he's gonna talk to us, but he even he don't know what's going on. Doug, you know what's going on? I never know what's going on. Never know what's going on. All right, we are gonna tell Doug, what was the goal to get these layouts done? Doug, done. This one's finished. Done. Very nice. All right. Very nicely done. Now we got, this is a example of what you can do in your garden as a garden railroad. So the idea is to set this up outside and run it outside. But since we here at St. Mary's Museum are all about education, because we're still trying to teach Doug something. Ah! Okay. Um, we would like to show you how you can do this on your own outdoor landscape. And that's the latest and greatest in G-Gauge railroading. And um, uh, we also got a little bit of O-Gauge in the center just to give it that final touch. So uh, what do you think, Doug? I think it's great. Even though I've always been a bad pupil, I have learned a little bit. All right. I learned enough to stay away from foamers. OK, there you go. They'll talk your ears off. All right, well, <laughs> let's see what we got here. Let's turn them on. OK, here we go. Here we go. This is kind of the golden spike moment. This is the O gauge starting off here. This is your, your standard line L. All right. On the inside track, this is Doug's favorite train. This is the Jack Daniels, uh, Jack Daniels distillery train here. That's a nice one. DJ said he's gonna ride that one after the rehearsal. <laughs> <laughs> and over here, we have the Southern Railroad Swanee Express. Oh, wow, we got food going go different ways. Nice. And here we go. And if you notice on the back of this one, you got Uncle Phil or Papa Phil and Uncle Cy hanging out. <laughs> and as you notice, it goes through our spooky tunnel. We've got a waterfall over there. We've got a duck. There's some other little things for the kids up on the, uh, the tunnel there. we got Batman. We're going to nah, do a nah, little nah, thing nah. when the kids come down, you know, uh, see if we can pick out how much stuff there is. There's a tiny little snake. There's Willie Robinson sitting over in there. This is a spooky swamp, and there's some spooky stuff over there. Then we have uh, the strobe light going on in the tunnel, all that. So, Doug, did we exceed your vision on this? I didn't have a vision. Okay, well, <laughs> okay. Well, what do you think, Doug, the boss man? I think that uh, it looks fantastic. I think kids will love it, and I think uh, adult foamers will love it just as much. <laughs> okay, so if this one's done and looks that good, just imagine how these other two are going to look. So. That, re that remains to be seen. <laughs> We're getting there. Good job. Four people can only do so much. So if you want to volunteer, please come help. Stop the, stop the honor. And, uh... All right, so signing off, say goodbye, Doug. Let me put this young child in. Okay, young child. Stand right here. Stand very close. There you go. Stand right here. That, that makes the whole thing look better, don't you? All right. Doug, we need to send something to Patty Crosby, like, Good morning, Jacksonville, from the St. Mary's Railroad Museum with our first operational layout. Okay. <laughs> we'll get your camera. We'll do that whenever. Thank you. What do you think? Say something to Barbara. Say, Barbara, we've been working hard. Doug. All right, we're signing off. No, no sign off yet. Oh. Hold on. So, uh, as we have here, we're going to take some more pictures. Woohoo! I'm over here. Hey, how you doing, everybody? All right, we're going to take some more pictures, but most and foremost, guess what? We're going to see you on the rails.